Hey, what's up, guys? And we are reacting to Ant Man Returns for Avengers Endgame. Here we go. Now, I have seen this movie, and my first reaction was. You know, I now kind of see what Doctor Strange means. It's like a 1 in 14 million chance that a rat will just so happen to go across a, like a time device and like get him out of the quantum realm. Uh, it all makes sense now because a lot of people were kind of mad about that movie goers they were like come on are you telling me a rat is the one yeah it makes sense the way they wrote themselves into it like dr strange was like yes so once one time okay it's a one in 14 million chance of different timelines and different scenarios where a rat is responsible for i guess saving the universe in a way This goes it's it's crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Oh. Now, you guys have to see Ant-Man and the Wasp to know what is going on. Because at the end of Ant-Man and the Wasp, another MCU film, part of the Infinity Saga, um, Ant-Man gets stuck in a quantum realm for five hours because of Hope Van Dyne not bringing him back. <laughs> Which is uh, crazy when you think about it. The chance of that happening, Thanos snapping, and then the people that are supposed to get him out the quantum realm can't get him out. And... Like it's been only five hours. <laughs> It's been five hours, but to them it's been, time works differently in the quantum realm. So it's, for him it's been five hours, but inside, well, in the regular world, not in the microverse, it's been five years. <laughs> Crazy, right? Crap. Move out of my way, dude. <laughs> this stupid fly in my way. Please don't. 
She probably thought her dad died in the whole snapture. You know, this is it's kind of setting up the young Avengers or the new Avengers, like with the kids being older. guys hope you enjoyed that video thank you so much make sure you subscribe if you are an avengers fan um and uh i would say thank you so much and peace